Last week I watched a police chase on YouTube that I was convinced was the slowest in the history of law enforcement. They were chasing a Tahoe that was driving under the speed limit using their turn signal. And it was honestly just like a really polite chase, if you can even call it that. It was more like a, like a motor ca cavalcade. And I thought to myself, golly, this is what it's all about. You know, this is speed. It doesn't get better than this. The intensity was off the charts. The adrenaline was pumping throughout my body just watching it. I can only imagine the rush of the officers as well as the, the woman driving the Tahoe. And I just didn't think it could go slower. Until today. I watched the video where the police chased down an Amish buggy. And it's, a, it's, it's as thrilling as it sounds. Body cam shows police in low speed chase of drunk Amish guy driving horse and buggy. <laughs> that goddamn menace. Okay. Just when you thought it was safe to go back on the road, now you gotta look both ways just in case old Abraham comes around in the horse and buggy. And he's been drinking. Whoa! Hey! Hey, Abe! Hey! Hey, you put that shit in park! Wake up! Good lord! <laughs> There's a Bud Light can sitting in there and he's passed clean out. <laughs> He'll go home. The horse knows how to get home. I'm gonna see if I can get in front of him and slow down. Well, you're gonna scare the horse if you do that. What is that plan? You better hope this guy hasn't tricked out that buggy with nitrous oxide boosters. Oh boy! Oh, now look what you done! Disregard. just rammed it into my car. Did you wait? You knew he was asleep, and you parked in front of him. What do you mean? Yeah, this guy just got Amish pit maneuvered here. This is entirely the officer's fault. He even said the guy is slumped over, passed out, and then he still slabs up in the middle of his, like, path. Hey! Stop your horse! What? <laughs> stop your horse! What? Yeah, let me just put it in a park real quick. Stop your horse! Get your horse. What do you want me to do? <laughs> he doesn't even know where he is right now. Man, just fucking peel out of there. The cops will never catch you. An old fashioned wild western chase here. Okay, grab the horse so it. Arrest that horse as well. Two, four, three. Repeating Victor Adam. Let's four, breathalyze three, it. Might two, be drunk. Four, three. I got around him and had him stop. No, what are you talking in the road? And then when I got out, he went to go around me and just rammed it right. To, and he Is... got busted his head. No, I don't think that's what happened at all. What? Pardon? What in tarnation? I, this guy was asleep. <laughs> I don't think he made like a conscious decision to go around. I think the horse itself panicked because of your fucking lights pulling up out of nowhere in the middle of the night. And the horse tried to get around you. Not the driver coming up with a conscious decision to try and drift around you. But let's let's watch it back. May, maybe I missed something. We might have it stopped. Nope. <laughs> Disregard. It's like stopping Santa's sleigh. Like you just put a roadblock in front of the reindeer. It's your fault. And even here, you said we might have it stopped, and then afterwards you're saying I had it stopped, which you didn't. You never you never had me. You never had your car, as Dominic Toretto said. Granny shifting, not double clutching like you should. And he stopped in the road, and then when I got out... Type of cop to put down to some road spike traps to right stop it. <laughs> and he's got busted his head. Yeah, get the spike tarp out. <laughs> I don't know. And I started walking around the corner of the car to grab the reins. And that's when what? he fucking took off. What are you doing? I, wa I watched your body cam. <laughs> what? Every time you get beside of him, he'd freaking speed up. It's an animal! You scared it! <laughs> the dude was asleep! He passed out! <laughs> you said so yourself! This man just made up his own fanfic on camera. Check the comments. No way the comments aren't calling that out. I love that the horse knows exactly where it's going like a self-driving Tesla. <laughs> the comments are kind of slapping. He fell asleep in the wagon, horse left for home, he technically wasn't driving, the horse was on autopilot. Don't see what's wrong, drunk guy has a designated driver. 
He's a passenger in an Amish Uber. Oh, here, yeah, now the, now the comment's calling it out. Anyone else catch the cop changing the story? Yeah. Yeah, this was, this was pretty interesting. This was a, some of the worst police work of all time.